When you run a Neptune Launchpad in a productive environment, it's good that you can run the Launchpad with minified files. So all the Neptune functionality is packed into this core JS with minified JavaScript. Pretty easy to load from the server, but it's not so easy to understand what's going on. So if you are in a development environment or test environment, instead of just running your launchpad, you can run your launchpad with debug files. This will add this parameter to the URL, which tells the server that you have to run the files as debug files. So when you now check your JavaScript folder, you'll see that you have a lot of debug files. This can be very useful if you want to check, for instance, how app cache load is working. Set a break on here and you can just follow along and see exactly how Neptune is doing it. This is the same thing for, for the app designer. If you want to run an application with debug files, you have a little debug button in there as well. So here you have the normal run and you can also run this in the browser with debug files. And just as uh, with the launchpad, you will have the debug files available for you to check out in the browser debug console. This will also be visible in the code generated by the server. Here you see the minified code with fewer line breaks and no indentation. If you check the code generated with debug enabled, you will see more line breaks and the code is proper indented so that it's much easier for you to set a breakpoint. The minified code generated by the server is of course structured in a way so that you also here can set breakpoints. 